just going to walk and talk with you for a minute. I haven't made a video in a couple of weeks. I've been under the weather and didn't really have the voice for it. But, um, I live in Tennessee now, but it's a heavy heart to make this video today talking about the officer who lost his life last night in eastern Kentucky. It's in Pikeville, Pike County. And uh, it's where I grew up. It's where I'm from. and It's one of the safest places on earth that I know of. Um, it's uh, just a really sad situation. And my heart goes out to, to his family and to everybody, all of his friends and his, his brothers and, you know, just everybody who's involved. He had a brand new little baby. She's only like nine months old. And I just feel bad for him, you know, because um, stuff like that just don't happen in Pipeville. Pikeville, Kentucky. Um, his name was uh, Officer Scotty Hamilton. He was working with the task force, and uh, it's unfortunate, but they were investigating uh, some suspicion, and they haven't really released all the details or anything yet, but, you know, I'm just pretty sure it probably had something to do with drugs, and I think that's something that really just gets looked looked over so much you know there's so many talks about everything that's wrong in the world all the political corruption and all that but really you know our downfall I believe a lot of our downfall a lot of the downfall of the youth that's out there right now is uh, to do with drugs you know so just a real heavy heart today to talk about Officer Scotty Hamilton. Um, just to show you how safe Pikeville is, he's only the second law officer to ever lose his life in the line of duty. Um, there was a, a guy, uh, Sheriff's Deputy James Thacker, who actually died in a car crash in 2012, but uh, the only other one to ever lose his life in the line of duty was a uh, Robinson I can't remember his first name but uh, he was shot by a guy they were trying to arrest in Happy Holler up there in Pike County and uh, and that was in 1929 so you know almost 90 years 80 89 years in between officer Robert Robinson and now uh, officer Scotty Hamilton so you know, troubling times and just parents, I mean, do whatever you can to keep your kids away from the pills and the opioids and the meth and, you know, that's that's probably the biggest biggest problem in uh, eastern Kentucky is pills and meth and drugs. I've lost a lot of classmates that I knew real well and grew up with and considered my best friends over the drug e epidemic but um just real quick you know just keep the people in Pipeville and officer, officer Hamilton's family his wife and his little child in your in your thoughts right now it's a tough time and there's still a manhunt going on there, you know. They still haven't caught these guys who did it. And, you know, it makes me worry about my family, you know, who lives there. I mean, they've been doing these searches looking for this guy with helicopters and drones and everything, you know, right around my sister's house today. So um, just keep everybody in your thoughts there. Peace out.